Welcome to the Terrible Take, a mini-podcast telling Steelers Nation what's on our mind. I'm Josh Carney. The center position is a glaring hole for the Pittsburgh Steelers, with just 16 days between now and the start of the 2024 NFL Draft. It might sound like I'm beating a dead horse here, and that's fine. It's largely true. The hole was created by their own doing, cutting Mason Cole in late February and then never addressing the position in free agency or via trade all while touting Nate Herbig as a potential answer at the center position. Lately, the talk about the need at center for the Steelers has, well, centered on the first round with names like Duke's Graham Barton, Oregon's Jackson Powers Johnson, and West Virginia's Zach Frazier gaining the most attention. But as things start to come together leading up to the draft, it appears that things are just going to be far too difficult for the Steelers to address all of their needs on the roster, while taking a center in the first round. Pittsburgh would be better off going offensive tackle in the first round, and then center later in the draft. That's a bit concerning for sure, but offensive line guru Duke Manyweather believes there are quality centers that can be had on day two and early day three into the fourth round for NFL teams. And guess what? He's right. Names like Georgia's Cedric Van Pran Granger, Arkansas's Bo Limmer, Penn State's Hunter Norzad, North Carolina State's Dylan McMahon, and even Florida's Kingsley Egwakun are names to know in that area of the draft. They might not be the big-name picks like one of the big three as previously mentioned, but all of them could step in and start right away for the Steelers, if that is what's needed. Based on how the roster looks currently, though, a day-one starter will be needed at the position. The last time the Steelers did this... They went with Kendrick Green, making him change positions from guard to center, and then subsequently watching him fail spectacularly. These prospects, though, they aren't Kendrick Green. There is real quality there. It might not be what the fans want initially in the draft with one of those big three names in the first round, but waiting until late day two or early day three, well, it could be quite lucrative for the Steelers at the center position. Be sure to follow us at SteelersDepot.com and check out episodes of The Terrible Take every day at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. And check out The Terrible Podcast with Alex Kazora and Dave Bryan every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday.